Veronica, have you ever wanted to copy text from a PDF to a Word document, paste formulas into Excel spreadsheet, or insert items into a PowerPoint slide for presentations? But using the simple copy and paste functions doesn't give you the same formatting. And for PDF files with security and other permissions, copy and paste might not work for all. Well, you are in the right place. In this video, you'll learn all about how to efficiently copy PDFs to Word documents, preserving their original format. Have you ever needed to copy and paste any of the following? Documents that are restricted and require permissions. Convert hundreds of pages from PDF into Word. Copy tables or graphs retaining their original format. Copy equations from PDF to Word. Or copy images from PDF to Word retaining their original quality. So if any of these apply to you, keep watching this video and we can solve this together. Welcome back to the PDF Element channel where we focus on improving productivity by learning all the tips and tricks that help us be more efficient. In the following tutorial, you'll learn how to copy PDFs into Word documents in multiple ways. I bet there is at least one that will save you so much time and hassle, so let's get going. How to copy text from PDF to Word for Windows and Mac OS users. First, check if the file protection is disabled. This is the one thing you should always be making sure of before copying text from a PDF to Word. As when it's enabled, you might not be able to copy all the contents of the PDF. You can check this by following these steps. Step one, open your PDF document. Right click on it and click on document properties from the options. Step two, in the pop-up window, go to the security tab. Step three, if it's marked as allowed, you're good to go ahead and copy the contents of the PDF. If not, then the owner of the PDF must have restricted access. A little side note, usually owner protected PDF files have the word secure written next to their name. If a PDF has privacy enabled, it won't allow you to copy anything. You must first remove the password or protection. If you have any questions regarding how to remove the password or protection in PDF, leave a comment in the comment section and we'll answer any questions you may have directly. Now, let's get straight to the point. If you have a PDF document without permission restrictions, then you can easily copy or edit any of its contents. It's very simple to do. So what are the copy and paste methods in PDF documents on Windows or Mac OS? Probably the most common and de facto way of copying text or other elements from a PDF is using the Control C on Windows and Command C on Mac OS shortcuts and using the Control V on Windows and Command V on Mac OS to paste into other documents. There are other ways to copy and paste. For example, you can use your mouse or touchpad by selecting the text you want to copy, dragging the mouse across it and right-clicking the selection and clicking copy. How to copy a page from PDF to Word. If your PDF file is large, for example, a document of hundreds or even thousands of pages, and you want to copy a few pages from that PDF into Word, you can use a dedicated PDF application like the Wondershare PDF Element. Its conversion capabilities can directly convert PDFs to Word so that you can easily add pages to a Word document. Also, Wondershare PDF Element has OCR optical character recognition features that can help you convert scanned or image-based PDF files into editable text where you can easily copy and paste the contents. Open the official website and you also find the link in the description below. So all you have to do is register and download the free version of PDF Element if you don't mind the watermark, of course. So let's see how to convert a PDF to Word. Step one, open the PDF Element on the main page, click on Open File and select PDF that you want to convert into a Word document and hit Open. Step two, select convert from the bar at the top and press to word from the ribbon toolbar to start the conversion process. Then select a folder location for your Word document. You can also change the name and hit save. To access your Word file, go to its folder location and double click on the file to open it in Word. And now you have successfully converted a PDF to Word. 
Here is a pro tip. If you need to copy multiple PDF documents into Word, then you can also use the batch option in PDF Elements to help you convert multiple PDF files to Word. To access the batch process, go to Convert and select Batch Process from the ribbon toolbar. Now click on Add File to add more PDF files to be converted into Word and choose your output format for this conversion process I'm using Word and select your output folder which is where you will find your converted files. Now press apply and you can see under status that the PDF files are being converted. Once the process is complete the output folder will be automatically opened and you can open your Word documents. How to copy tables, signatures, images and more from a PDF to Word. Copying PDF elements to Word one by one is a hectic way of doing things. Even if you copy an entire PDF to Word, you might not get the same formatting on the tables and images. So in situations like this, you can use a PDF to Word converter to preserve the layout of your PDF. PDF element is one such tool that helps its users convert PDF documents to Word with their original format and quality. This utility can be used on a variety of devices such as desktops, web browsers and smartphones. It's so easy to use and you can start with the trial version. Let's see how to copy grids and graphs from a PDF to Word, which when done directly may potentially offer a different quality than the original PDF. Sometimes the formatting gets all messed up after you copy and paste, like when I try to copy and paste this table. This happens because Word has a different format. But PDF element makes things easier. Follow these steps. Step 1. Ensure that Wondershare PDF element is installed on your device. You can find the software download link in the description below. Step 2. Click File and choose Open. Select the PDF document you want to copy a table from. Step 3. Below the conversion menu bar, at the top, you'll see different options. I'm going to choose two words, since we are converting a PDF with tables to Word in this case. Step 4. After conversion, you can open the converted file and copy the grids and graphs using shortcut methods mentioned earlier in the video. This part is for copying equations from PDF to Word. If you're still frustrated with how to copy formulas from PDF to Word in the original format, then you have come to the right place. The following steps will show you how to copy equations from PDF to Word. Step 1. Launch the Wondershare PDF element and import the PDF file containing the equations you want to copy to Word. Step 2. Click Edit in the top menu bar and select Equation. Step 3. Right click the equation and choose Copy Text or you can simply press Ctrl C or Command C. Step 4. Open the Word document and paste the contents of the clipboard. You have now successfully copied the formula from your PDF to Word with its original format. This part is for copying images from PDF to Word. Be patient, we've saved the most important part for last. You've probably seen lots of suggestions on the internet on how to copy pictures from a PDF to Word, such as using the snipping tool. But they are nothing more than taking screenshots. They are simple enough, but your images will lack the original quality. Let's talk about how PDF Element can copy pictures from PDF to Word without any quality loss. Step 1. Import a PDF with some images into PDF Element. Step 2. Now find the image you want to copy and right click on it. Step 3. Choose Extract Image, name it and choose a location to save it. And click the Save button. These are all solutions for copying from PDF to Word using PDF Element. Even a simple copy and paste function can have a lot of skill to master. If you are a PDF Element user, then don't miss out on any of these solutions you may not have known before. This applies to the free users too, but I hope you don't mind that your exported files will have product watermarks. And here is a bonus tip. If you don't want to register with Wondershare PDF Element, you can Google search Hi PDF. Open their official website and you will find online solutions for copying and pasting there. Now it's time for our You Ask, We Answer section. Let's take a look at what our audience is curious about. Question, can you recommend me a free file converter? I do work with Quark Express program and I need to convert PDF and I cannot find a good converter. And the answer is sure, why not try Hi PDF? 
is a totally free online solution. There will be links to their website in the description below and pinned to the top of the comment section so that you can easily find it. Also, if you are a Mac user, try using the native preview. You can also copy and paste PDF to Word quickly using it. Question, how to copy text from PDF to Word without line breaks? Hmm, I had a very similar problem before. I didn't use any app to copy text, so when I copied a particular paragraph and pasted it, it wasn't in its original format. The sentences appeared in half in each line. One way to solve this is to delete the breaks manually, but it's so time consuming. So the answer to this question is to select the text in Word by dragging your mouse across it, press Ctrl H or Command H if you're a Mac OS user, and in the dialog box, go to the Replace tab. Click More, then Special and select Paragraph Mark from the drop-down menu. Next, press Replace All and choose note when the software asks you if you want to search the remainder of the document. And now we have our text appear as a whole paragraph in an automated manner. And that's all we have time for today. Copying text from a Word document, website or any other text editor is easy. However, sometimes it can get complicated when you try to copy text from a PDF. So hopefully this video gave you lots of useful tips to deal with situations when the text or other elements you are trying to copy don't appear in the same format. If you like this video, please give it a like. And if you want to learn more about office productivity or PDF knowledge, leave us a comment below. And subscribe to our channel so that you never miss any of our useful suggestions. See you next time.